Hey, I'm Amy and welcome or welcome back. And today I'm going to talk about Coda, the new Apple TV Plus original movie in two minutes or less. This is also a pick by my patrons. It is a Patreon pick. Once a month, I will give my Patreon patrons, I will give my patrons a list of a couple movies that I am going to be watching and want to talk about that month and they get to pick which one I will be talking about on here so if you want to be a part of that definitely check the link in the description down below to check out my patreon so let's get started I really enjoyed this movie I thought it was very very cute it was not what I expected it to be I thought it was going to be more of a family drama type film but it ended up being a little bit more of a teen rom-com combined with a coming of age I also really enjoyed the fact that even though I don't know any deaf people or any coda people which coda means children of deaf adults I really thought it did a great job of showing what it is like to be a child of a deaf adult or also to just live in a deaf family or be a deaf person in general. It shows a very normal looking family, which I absolutely love. The cast is really, really great. Marley Matlin is probably the best known out of most of the cast, for me at least. She is one of the first and I think only deaf person to have been nominated for and win an Academy Award. And she was also the star of the narrative portion of what the Bleep Do We Know documentary that was produced or made by the leader of the Nexium cult, which you know is very fun. Also, Eugenia Derbez is great in this. He definitely plays the stereotypical teacher person. There are definitely some stereotypical rom-com and coming of age beats in this and Eugenia Derbez definitely hits the stereotypical teacher mentor beats in this but he's still really great. He's still very funny. He's mostly known for I think films in Mexico. I have seen at least one of his films. It was a film I think I did for Patreon once. It was very funny and I like him and I probably will watch more of his films after this. But the star of this is Amelia Jones. She stole the show. She was very fantastic and I thought she played her role very, very well. But that's it. It's really quick, I know, but it's very cute. It's a very nice little heartwarming film and I recommend watching it if you do have Apple TV Plus and if you've bought a new Apple device in the past like two years I think you get like a free year of Apple TV Plus and it's one that I highly recommend watching if you have that but my rewatch score for this though would probably be Redbox it's not one that I would rewatch quite a lot but I did enjoy watching it while I watched it because I'm not like a romantic comedy teen rom-com kind of person. I just, it's rom-coms aren't my thing, but I did love the family drama, family aspect of the whole film. So let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. If you have seen Coda, what do you think? I have not heard anything bad about this film. I've only heard good things about it. So let me know what you think in the comments down below. But thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really, truly do appreciate you, whoever you are. Let me know who you're in the comments down below. And let's be friends. If you enjoyed this, leave a like and subscribe if you do. Because I love talking on these movies, TV shows, filmmaking, mystery, all that fun stuff. And I'll see you next time. Bye.